The diagram shows a hemispherical bowl. The internal diameter is 25 centimeters, so that means from here to here, we have 25 centimeters, not including the thickness. And the bowl has a thickness of five millimeters. Find the volume of material used to make the bowl. Give your answer correct to three significant figures. Okay, first of all, we need to know the volume of a sphere, which is on the exam paper, which is four thirds pi r cubed, but we only have a hemisphere, so the volume of a hemisphere will be half of that, which is two thirds pi r cubed. So in order to solve this question, all we need to know is what the radius of the internal bit is and the radius of the external bit. And then if we subtract the two, we will get the volume of the whole shape. So the internal radius will be 25 divided by two, which is 12.5 centimeters. So from here to here, but not including the thickness is 12.5 centimeters. And the external radius is going to be 12.5 plus 5 millimetres. Now, 5 millimetres is half a centimetre, so we make sure the units are consistent. So it's 12.5 plus 0 0.5, which is 13 centimetres. So the distance from here to the outer edge here will be 13 centimetres. Right, the volume of the material used will be the volume of the whole shape with uh, a radius of 13 minus the volume of the inside uh, sphere, which has a radius of 12.5. So it's 2 thirds times pi times 13 cubed minus 2 thirds times pi times 12.5 cubed. Now, you could do this all in one go on your calculator. Make sure you use the fraction button and that you put in everything uh, correctly. Now, when you press your equals button on your calculator, particularly it's in math mode, you'll get uh, the exact answer, which is 1,951 pi divided by 12. If you press the S to D button, it will give you 510 point something centimeters cubed. And therefore, you round that off to three significant figures, so that seven makes that zero or one. So the correct answer for this exam question will be 512 centimetres cubed to three significant figures. So this has been a video to show you how to find the volume uh, of material needed in order to make a hemispherical bowl. I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.